The Samsung Galaxy S24 series is locked and loaded. We'll be having a first look at the lead Galaxy S24 Ultra Prime specs, along with Samsung's key role in the making of iPhone 16. We'll talk about everything right after this. Today I came back to the house and found a mystery package in the mail from a mystery tech company. I legit have no idea what is inside, so we're gonna have to take a look at this together. As you guys know, I'm so impatient, so I'm just gonna open this and see what's inside and well this is interesting are you ready a more sustainable phone is coming you have been selected to be among the first to join the revolution this lockbox will open at exactly 5 p.m on september 12 2023 until then sit tight wow i am intrigued to see what's gonna be inside this box and well it seems like there is indeed a five day timer on this there's no way to open this box so looks like we have to wait this video is technically sponsored but we don't know from who all this mystery will be solved in five days on september 12th so stay tuned Alrighty, here is the league specification for the s24 ultra coming from one of the trusted sources on the web it finally gives us the complete picture of what to expect with this next big thing according to this leak it seems like samsung will be keeping the same ultra wide as well as the selfie and the long range zoom the only two camera sensor we're getting is the main 200 mp sensor that is now improved and more optimized for the absolute best performance and of course we have the 50 megapixel 3x zoom and yes it is going to be the most premium samsung galaxy flagship ever made titanium frame is indeed coming yes it is first happening on the iphone 15 pro and the 15 pro max but thankfully samsung is not behind making the s24 ultra premium and lighter than ever we'll have android 14 based on one us 6.0 of course the complete final edition along with the same 5000 mAh battery and with the same 45 watt charging with that being said there will be some battery improvements thanks to the snapdragon 8 gen 3 chip and of course the 9 which is the Exynos 2400 possibly expected to be on the same level as the 8 Gen 3 chip. Last time we talked about how it is 100% confirmed for Europe. Now the latest rumors are talking about another market which is surprisingly going to be Samsung's own home country the South Korean market. Yes South Korea could get Exynos 2400 which means Samsung is actually very optimistic and brave about their Exynos comeback. You know what they might actually be onto something but again only time will tell what this chip is going to bring now last but not the least like all iphones the upcoming iphone 16 series will be dependent on samsung more than ever before yes in addition to that all display oled panel that samsung is making for that dream iphone they're also making a new kind of mla oled display for the iphone 16 series according to south korean media thanks to this mla technology the display on the iphone 16 series will bring absolute record-breaking brightness and power efficiency gains this screen has currently been used in some of the oled tvs from lg so having the latest generation amoled tech on a smartphone is going to be a huge breakthrough so that's all of this news let me know what you think about the key specs for the galaxy s24 ultra as always if you guys are new here be sure to subscribe with that being said i'll see you guys later peace out